see. It goes up and down. Shit. He's cool, but he's a trash character. You, do you guys want to know why he's bad? This is this is anti-air, by the way. This is anti-air. Wait, they gave me top lane. Cool. I think. Wait, did I get it? You can top. Thank you. All right. I'm going against Gangplank. Uh. Going against Gangplank. Going against Gangplank. Going against Gangplank. You know what, man? I'm down to do Riven into Gangplank. If it's not if it's not banned, I can do it. I, I don't know. It doesn't. It, it's not really that bad of a matchup. It's just farm lane, especially if I go D shield. Anyway, look, look at it. you guys want to see Krillin's anti air. This is his anti air. Like that, like that, like look at the fucking range of this fucking anti air. It's fucking nothing. He has no range. This character is the most trash thing I've ever seen. And people wonder why some characters like that just aren't viable. <laughs> he wants that there. Yeah. Yeah, it'd be sick if it'd be sick watching Tyler play fighting games. What do you guys think? Where am I going? Top lane? Or mid? I think I'm going top. What I'm learning new champs? I am, I'm still doing it. I just, uh, dude, I've been spamming other champions for like the past two days or three days. I like, I still got, I, I don't want to, I don't want to let my Riven go full rust, you know? I don't want, I don't want it, I don't want it to go down to like, uh, what do you call it? Whose level? Wh whose level would I not want my Riven to go down to? What do you think? Wh who do you guys think? If I didn't play Riven for like a year, what level would it be at? I, I can do this against GP. I actually don't mind the GP matchup as Riven. Not that much anyway. Um, there's some range matchups that are um, like super unbearable though. So I want to spam champions, right, to learn them. But I'm also like yeah, I'm mixing up a ribbon game in between in between them here and there. This wave is pushing back to me. I don't need to be. I don't need to recall either. It's pretty good.
So this T shield is supposed to be better if you get like put out like a low HP, right? Their jungler's listen. Okay. It'd be better if you got a one account ribbon only, and their account with other specific champions. That actually sounds good. So, what account do you guys think should be my uh, my ribbon account? Just this one, Adrian Riven. I just use Riven in this account all the time, and then Adrian Sarah, I use all the other champions. I can do that once the season starts, or I mean, we can start doing it now. But the, actually, I can't do that. We'll make it. We'll make it the other, the my other master account because I can't find matches on my challenger account. So I should just leave that account for when the season starts. Oh, Lee Sin's coming up here. <laughs> I'm just gonna reset here because I think uh, I'm. Just staying back because we just saw there. I mean, I can't do that. No, and thinking about it, I can't do that either because I want to pick for counter picks too. And if I have an account where I can only play specific champions, it ruins the whole point. Pretty low. Nice, we got the least sun. I haven't got an assist for it too. Okay, that's good enough. We got his flash. Okay, this isn't good though. 
Let's just back it up. I'll take that. What a, what, a, what a funny game. Let's, let's just get out. Dude, this, this guy can't play the game. It's fucked. Well, you know what I want to do? We're going to do that. We're uh, a little ahead. Wow, that movement speed. Fuck. Did you guys hear that? By the way? Because they're doing some construction in like the next room, like next to mine. They're like fixing up the, the floor. Right, I'm gonna mute myself for a little bit. It's not that bad. Oh, you don't need to mute? Okay, okay, okay. We'll keep it there. If it gets, if, if they do something too loud, then I'll, I'll mute. So you guys don't, uh, don't get shit on. Yeah, like I just look for, I just look for the little mistakes here and there that I'm making, and if I make any that, that are bad enough to like lose me a game, I'll, I correct them. Honestly, I play pretty efficiently. I don't really, I don't really see myself making like game-breaking mistakes, like to the point where I just lose the game off of it. Okay. I'm gonna dive this guy here. Yep. There's no way we're gonna play that there. Yo, don't wants to go fuck with me here. That's... Get him. I don't wanna. I don't wanna die. You got him. You don't have him. Oh no. Please. I'm not going for him. No. I could actually. I know I know what you want to do here, man. Nice try, guy. Bastard. <laughs> well, hey man, you're the one playing Victor. What do you want me to do?
Well, this Ezreal is super strong, but I'm still level 12 and he's level 10, so what's the worst that he could do to me? What's the worst that could happen? Why is the map so red? Because of the uh, Infernal is the next dragon, so the, the map changes according to that. Personal favor, just please shit on that Ezreal. I will try, man. <laughs> Team game after all, though. I need, I need that Scion to help me out. Science doing make a call here. Too bad I got stopped. I need to get a couple more items. Fuck! 7 and 0, 1 and 14. Fuck. My, my bot lane just got shit on. Mm. How do I... I? I guess I have Death Dance now. I need. I need Last Whisper with a Lethality item to be able to actually just one shot their back line. Give me a second, boys.
this game, like League of Legends is set up so, like for solo queue, it's for practice. Like, you're practicing matchups, how to rotate, and all that. But you shouldn't really play it expecting to win. Because if you play it expecting to win, it's unrealistic. You can win like a 50 something percent on your games, 50 something percent. But it's unrealistic to carry people that int super hard every game. I mean, I've said this before a lot. It's really unrealistic. You shouldn't really bother with that. Is that about that bad design? Not really. It's just a team game. If you want to win every time, you, you play a 1v1 game, not a 5v5 game. So that's how you climb? Yeah, eventually, when you play and you win like at a 55%, 60% win rate, you climb eventually. That's just how it's set up. You lose like 45% of your games, and there's probably not much you can do about that. Unless you're smurfing. And if you smurf, once you get to the MMR, with the MMR, where the players are equal skill with you, it's, it goes back to that same thing. You win like 55% of your games, lose like 45% of them. Again, yeah, that, but that's that comes from a smurf though. If if Tarzan was to play a thousand games on that account, a thousand five hundred games or something like that, eventually his win rates would go down to 55, 54 percent.